Are you ready for some baseball? That's tomorrow, so April 8th. By the way, April 9th, that's uh, my birthday. Fun fact there. Here's a look at our first pitch forecast that is happening uh, for uh, the Corpus Christi Hooks versus San Antonio. We are going to see 76 degrees there around the first pitch, and then we will see clear skies and the stars will be out big and bright deep in the heart of Texas. Here we are. High pressure is what's leading to all of that sunshine, low humidity will be nice for that first game, but unfortunately those conditions do lead to high fire danger. So today we are looking at a red flag warning in place. You can see that here. Winds are out of the northeast 10 to 15 miles per hour, gusts up to 25 miles per hour and relative humidity will be below 30%. In fact, uh, our islands are even under that red flag warning because your humidity will be below the 40% criteria for that red flag warning. So very dry conditions, not only in our air, but on our soil due to drought conditions, high temperatures ranging from 75 to 85 today. And those winds again out of the north, uh, a, a tad breezy, not as strong as yesterday, but we could still see some gusts around 25 miles per hour. Today's high temperature 83 in Corpus Christi, 84 in Robstown. So we're not quite as hot into the brush country. You'll see lighter winds uh, and uh, temperatures in the mid 80s. 77 there in Port Aransas for your high today. Uh, hour by hour, let's take you through it. So we are starting off on the cool side this morning with temperatures in the 50s. And then we're going to see the sunshine come up. Heating temperatures up will be around 81 degrees uh, by 3 p.m. Winds do pick up around 11 a.m. They'll be breezy around 15 to 20 miles per hour through about 5 p.m. Then we'll see lighter winds again heading into the night, and that will allow for lows in the 50s and 40s tomorrow night. So here's that area of high pressure. It's going to shift south, and that's why our winds will be lighter heading into Friday. So we'll keep lighter winds on Friday, but then watch what happens over the weekend. High pressure moves offshore. We get southerly flow back on Saturday and Saturday evening. Cloud coverage starts to return. We'll see partly cloudy skies on Sunday. There is a slim chance for a shower, uh, mostly Sunday, late afternoon and into the evening. A better shot of rain across Texas as the dry line develops there Monday. Unfortunately, this is going to lead to the risk of severe weather across north and east Texas, but rainfall still looks slim for us in south Texas. As the high pressure does shift offshore, our humidity is going up. So while it is very pleasant and comfortable, not only today, tomorrow and into Saturday, we start to feel humid as kind of that tropical feeling air moves in early next week. So yeah, you're going to notice that humidity by Sunday. So if you do have plans to head out to Sandfest or Windfest uh, happening this weekend, Sunday is going to be the day where we have the strongest wind and the highest humidity. Wind gusts will be up to 40 miles per hour there on Sunday. And then temperatures warming into next week. We do see the chance of a cold front behind that 92 degree day next Wednesday. Barbie John Thomas.